MSC Connected Environments is all about how digital technologies can be used to help us instrument and understand the built and natural environment. We're very much focused on technologies like the Internet of Things. A key part of the philosophy behind the course is learning through doing, learning through making. They design things, they sense things, they deploy things. The marketplace needs people who understand how AI communicates with the Internet of Things with real-time data. We're getting students to basically do that prototyping and building things, almost kind of experiment with making these new products or services. I wanted to do something that would refresh my skills and really introduce some new aspects that I'd never touched before. And this course, being so broad, there's plenty of opportunity to touch on new things. Anything you can dream up, you can pretty much build. I chose this course because the practical and the theoretical aspect is really balanced. I found it really unique. The course is split into two phases. So the first term, where students are learning kind of some of the core skills and the techniques. And then in the second term, it's more applied and there'll be some group project work and some discussions around kind of the business and the ethics around those technologies. We're based out of UCL East over in the Olympic Park. We have this wonderful living lab environment there where we're treating the building and the surrounding environment as the laboratory where we do this research and teaching activities. Um, so this is a fantastic project called Shazam for Bats which is where we're listening to the bat calls and then we're counting the number of bats that we're hearing. So this gives us an idea of the number of bats and kind of when they're active within the park area. There is an openness to take connected environments in whatever direction you choose. So my dissertation project combines my interests in olfaction and like social neuroscience and meditation. It's about visualizing brainwave data and also like working on the emotional salience of smell. The style of learning on this program is, is very, very hands-on. You're printing, cutting, laser cutting, designing. CASA provides us with the latest equipment, and this equipment really help us to quickly turn our imagination into real product. I did a water drinking monitor system in my dissertation project. So there is an ultrasonic sensor under the cup and it will record the water level. And then all the data will be sent to the Firebase. I think what I enjoy most is the constant opportunity to expand my imagination. Don't be afraid to showcase your imagination and ideas. And also don't be afraid to feel that your ideas is really difficult to realize because the C team is always there to help you. With the skills that I've learned this year, I'm able to combine those with some of the things that I've done in the past around software. My intention is to start a company which will focus on both software and hardware. The course gave me the ability to visualize what I have in mind on paper and then turn it into reality. So this is 3D printed e-paper smartwatch. It's based on open source design. This is an example of something that I learned how to do. I didn't have the skill before the, the course. I had no experience in this space. I feel like it's given me, or it's really empowered me to be able to take on my own project and pursue my interests in this space. The whole aim of the course was to make sure people can go out into the workplace with the knowledge base that we know companies need. It's about building people who can actually go out, build things, and to improve people's everyday life.